Hey everyone, so I wanted to share a review and swatch video on these hard candy nail polishes that I came across at Walmart. In this collection, there are a variety of colors. They range from solids, glitters, shimmery colors, and then these that I'm about to share with you guys. I only chose a few out of the bunch because I was kind of leaning more towards the spring and summer colors. The majority of the colors were more on the darker side. I also wanted to give them a try first before I decide to purchase more in the future. So before I swatch the colors, I'm just going to share with you guys a brief description of the bottles and pricing as well. So here's one of the polishes and it's packaged in a really cute cylinder type of bottle. And on the cap, it just has their brand name and then it tells you how many fluid ounces you get. So there's 0 0.26 fluid ounces. So the cost for each bottle is $4. It is kind of pricey, but I want to see the quality first before I decide if it is worth your money. These four bottles right here, those are actually part of one collection and then this one right here is part of another collection. The display that they have at Walmart, there's about, I think, five or six rows and each one has its own collection. Since my nails are painted, I'm gonna swatch them on these fake nails that I have here. So we'll start off with this bottle right here, and this one definitely caught my eye. And this one's called Black Tie Optional. So I'm gonna start off with one coat, and I'm not applying a whole lot to the brush. So there's one coat. So this is how it looks like with the second coat. So just putting it by the bottle, it doesn't look like it would have those long strips of glitter. So that's kind of nice. The next one is this one right here and it's a mint green. It looks like it either has blue or black glitters in it along with the silver and this one is called gummy green so that's how it looks like with one coat And here's the second coat of that. And I'll put the swatch next to the bottle so you guys could get more of an idea. The next bottle is this one right here and it's kind of like a bubblegum pink and it has blue and silver glitters in it. That's how it looks like with the second coat. This one actually turned out nice, but I don't know if I am a big fan of the color combo. I think they could have used different colored glitters, I guess. So that's that color. And this one is called Cotton Candy Pink. So here's the next bottle. And it looks like a really nice sky blue. And it looks like it has different shades of blue glitters in it as well. I actually like this one as well. The color combo is really nice. The last bottle is this one right here and it's a really pretty lilac or lavender type of color and it has pink, blue, and silver glitters in it. This one is called Pixie Pink. So that's how it looks like. Overall, I'm loving all of the polishes except for the color combo glitters that they have for the pink, um, but I do love the pink shade. The color payoff is really nice as well. I didn't have to apply a lot onto the brush to get the actual color, 
so that's really nice. Um, another thing I might have to try in the future is working with the glitters. I don't know if you guys could tell in the video, but when you apply the first coat, all the glitter goes towards the top part and then it fades through the bottom as you guys could see right there. I think for the second coat, I would just have to work where the gaps are. So for the price that you pay for these, which again are $4 a bottle, I think it's pretty worth it just because each bottle has its own uniqueness, especially this one right here. I really, really like this one. I haven't seen any other brand with, type, with this type of um, glitters. I'm definitely going to check out the other ones that they have. So I hope this helped you out a little bit if you guys were planning to purchase these. I think you guys should give it a try, especially for spring and summer. I think these colors are perfect for that season. So with that being said, thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!